So I have some Chinese cartoons here and uh, I kind of want to clean up the file names. So uh, we see some pattern here. Um, I guess y you can use VDIR, which is like a nice uh, program that you you can edit your file names in a in Vim, and then if you uh, after you save it, it will automatically rename the files, right? But I'm just gonna use ls here. We see some pattern here. Uh, we have some things in brackets which we don't really want. So I guess I can do this. Um, do I actually need screen key? I guess not. I don't know. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> so let's remove the thing in brackets, right? So S bracket, don't forget to escape it. And then star. And then we, since we don't want to use a dot star because if if we use a dot star here, I guess I'll, uh, you know, I'll let you see. We, we have some weird things because if there are multiple uh, brackets, you know, uh, because there are two brackets here in the in this spot, so it deletes everything. So. Uh, to fix that, we will just specify it. So as long as it hasn't found uh, a closing bracket, it will match, right? So, okay, that works. And we have leading some leading white space. So let's fix that. So leading white space, I guess we can use the caret uh, for the start of the line and then I guess space right space and then we use a star to match zero or more space um, does that work? no? why does that not work? <laughs> what? Oh yeah, I forgot this. Okay, that works. <laughs> okay, now we have some leading or trailing white space. Um, actually, the trailing white space is like in the um, in the uh, before the extension. So uh, let's do dot and then uh, dollar sign to match the last uh, line or last line, last character or from the last character and then we are going to just I guess not dot right as long as uh, we're, we're going to select the last dot right so uh, as long as it's, it's not a dot it's gonna match that uh, where is it oh star right and then here we will just uh, space right space space star which will match all the white space before right before the extension and then actually we we still want the extension right so we will capture that with uh, parens so we will do that. Uh, actually, what what didn't work here? <laughs> uh, maybe the space here. I need two brackets. Okay, that works. Just a syntax thing. And then what else? Well, I can go all day long, <laughs> I guess. But the point is, you can com combine these uh, things and then you can like make a script for that so here I have combined them all uh, and yeah so I use Perl because well it's it's probably better for this I think so oh my gosh 
home download torrent and then so I can do this and then I can see the new names if I found anything weird I can see and if it looks fine I can do rename and uh, the files are renamed right so yeah uh, 